You're the one that almost hit my wife with the microphone in the face? I did not oh, you didn't? almost hit your yeah? wife. Yeah? I honestly did yeah? not. We have you want to apologize to her on camera? I, I asked you a question. Her. Do you want to apologize to her? I asked you a question. Okay, get the out of here. nothing wrong. I did nothing wrong. I did nothing wrong. Oh, he's a charmer. That was actor Alec Baldwin today in New York unleashing another epic rant, this time on a local Fox affiliate reporter. But his outburst did not stop there. Watch this. But I, but I do want to tell you, no, 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 please come with me one second. No, 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 let me tell you something. No, no, the blonde, I do want to press charges against her. She assaulted my wife yesterday and almost hit her in the face. I want to okay. press charges okay, against so the we'll blonde. Take, we'll, we'll take it our we'll information. Take yeah. See that blonde woman? I want to press charges against her. Okay. okay. Let's get her over here. Okay. Have a seat. She's the one I want to press charges against. You want to press charges against me? That's your I'm You want to press charges against me? You want to press charges against me? I'm asking you. Let me just talk. The one he wants to press charges against, Fox affiliate WNYW reporter Linda Schmidt with me now. Uh, wow, he is, he really is a gentleman. Uh, you know what? That was clear. I have to tell you, Megan, I went into this day, I had no idea that my day was going to turn out like this. I didn't even know I was going to be covering the story. And to start out this morning, he had threatened one of my colleagues um, from uh, the Good Day New York program. And so as a result of that, he threatened him twice. So after that, our bosses decided, you know what, this story is done. Because the whole reason we were even there today, this morning, and yesterday is because of the trial that happened right. involving the stalker. He's been in the news. He had a stalker who was going right. after him. And he even testified during the trial and broke down and cried during the trial. So anyway, she was convicted yesterday. So that was the only reason we were at the house yesterday and that my colleague was at the house this morning as a follow-up. Right, you're not some paparazzi just trying no, to get no, a picture no, no. of Alec Baldwin. No, this was a legitimate news story. So he threatens my colleague this morning. My bosses then end up having a meeting and everybody decides, you know what, the story's done. We did it yesterday. We covered the trial. We were there this morning as a follow-up. Now it's done. The story is over. We don't want to pile on. A short time later, we get a report that he has allegedly assaulted another reporter in front of his apartment here in New York City. And allegedly uttered an anti-gay slur. That was yesterday. Yeah. Yes, okay. that was yesterday, but uh, uh, allegedly assaulted another reporter today. So as a I result... I can't keep up with all the, all the alleged assaults. I, I, it's just one right, right after the next, it seems. So as a result, our boss then sends me down there to say, okay, look, go down there, because now it's, again, a legitimate news story, and he might end up being arrested if he's charged with assault. Only reason that we were down there uh, today at all. So when you went there, you weren't really anticipating that you might get charged with assault or at no. least have a threat leveled against you. He was ticked off at you because you had asked, tried to get a comment from his wife yesterday. Yesterday, and right. and the and I want to tell the viewers the alleged assault that he accuses Linda of the the moment where you allegedly almost chipped her tooth. <laughs> Watch for yourselves. You did she assault her? The woman being found uh, guilty today. <laughs> Anything to say? I, I have something to say. Get away from me. Any comments about the verdict? Mm. Now, see, after this, she then tells her publicist and her husband that I assaulted her in front of her apartment, and this is the video that we're talking about here, and that I nearly knocked her teeth out with my microphone. we got to roll it again what, okay. it, we, we, so the viewers can see how you, how you almost Any comments about the woman being that. found uh, guilty today? <laughs> Anything Whoa! to say? I, I have something to say. Get away from me. Any comments? Uh, this whole show so far, the first 26 minutes of the show has been about living in fantasy land. And this is just the latest chapter in it. <laughs> Assault? Almost knocked her teeth out? What are right, they right. So, so what's your feeling? When you see Alec Baldwin, he's a big man. He, he's mm -hmm. aggressive. I mean, he's so aggressive. And, you know, you're a tall woman, but right. it's, it's a man angry, in your face. Right. What are you thinking? Right. Well, I was shocked, actually, that he came over because his wife had spotted me and then went over to him as they were leaving their apartment and getting into their car to say, that's the woman she's pointing to me. That's the woman over there that nearly knocked my teeth out yesterday with the microphone. She's instigating because everybody knows him and his temper. Right. So then she, the, so then he comes over to me and then launches into this tirade, just screaming and yelling at me. And there was no way that I was going to back down. I was professional about it. Yeah. I didn't lose my cool. I didn't hear any But I just you. said, but I, no expletives coming from this mouth, that's for sure. And I just said to him, look, I did not 
uh, assault your wife yesterday. I did not almost knock her teeth out. Your wife is exaggerating what happened. Did, did and we the have police ever charge you? It. No, I was never charged. That's because you didn't charged. assault her. Correct. <laughs> Correct. I will go on the record right now predicting there will be no charges against Linda. <laughs> wow. Well, it's interesting to get uh, that perspective. And, you know, I think we all know what we're dealing with when yeah. we see these Alec Bolton stories one after the other. I do want to tell our audience that uh, we just received news tonight that MSNBC has has suspended. Is that the word? Suspended his show? in the wake of this allegation that he uttered an anti-gay slur at another reporter yesterday. Linda, thank you. You're very welcome. I just want to add one last uh, sure. quick thing here. The NYPD, the officers actually came up to me after all of this happened to make sure that I was okay and that I was not injured Good in for any them. way. Good yeah. for them. Good to see you. Thank you.